Hi there, my name is Nick and I am a student at UNLV. Today I'm going to teach you how to properly wash your hands. This information being taught to you is made possible by using Audacity and Dragon Dictation. You can follow my tiny URL links to get to my posts on Tumblr and YouTube. Before learning how to properly wash your hands, you must first know why proper hand washing is important. Anything you touch can contain bacteria, and you could spread this bacteria to anything you touch if you do not take the time to wash your hands properly. Contaminated hands can spread salmonella, E. coli, staph, pneumonia, the cold, and the flu. By properly washing your hands, you can greatly reduce the spread of bacteria. Did you know that 80% of communicable diseases are transferred by touch? Here is a list of when you should wash your hands. Before, during, and after preparing food. Before and after eating food. Before and after caring for someone who is sick. Before and after treating a cut or wound. After using the restroom. After changing diapers or cleaning up a child who has used the restroom. After blowing your nose, coughing, or sneezing. After touching an animal, animal feed, or animal waste, and after touching garbage. Congratulations! You now know the importance of washing your hands properly and when to wash your hands. Next I am going to teach you how to wash your hands properly. The first step to properly washing your hands is wetting them with clean running water. Next, apply soap and lather your hands. Make sure to get the back of your hands between your fingers and under your nails. Did you know most bacteria on our hands is on the fingertips and under the nails? After lathering your hands, scrub your hands for at least 20 seconds. For every 15 seconds spent properly washing your hands, 10 times more bacteria is removed. Next, rinse your hands thoroughly under clean running water. Then, dry your hands using a clean towel. Disposable paper towels are the best way to dry your hands. Cloth towels contain many bacteria. Did you know damp hands are a thousand times more likely to spread bacteria than dry hands? Lastly, turn off the water with the towel you use to dry your hands. Then, dispose of the towel. Congratulations! You have now washed your hands properly. Now let's review the steps to washing your hands properly. First, wet them with clean running water. Next, make sure you apply soap and lather your hands, making sure you get the backs of your hands, between your fingers, and under your nails. Then scrub your hands for at least 20 seconds. Next. Rinse your hands thoroughly under clean running water. Then dry your hands using a clean disposable towel. And lastly, turn off the water with a disposable towel. Thank you for watching. And again, this wouldn't have been possible without the help from YouTube, Tumblr, TinyURL, and Dragon Dictation. This video wouldn't have been possible without the help from these links below. For more information, click on these links. They are very helpful. Now that you know how to properly wash your hands, make sure you do it from here on out and help spread the information to anyone that may not know how to properly wash their hands. Again, thank you all very much for listening and tuning in. I hope this helped many people. Have a good day.